Welcome to the center of key. In this video, I'm going to share with you how to practice alternate nostril breathing. There's a few different techniques. I'm just going to show you one of those today. And there's lots and lots of other videos on YouTube that you can learn more about this technique from. But basically, the main purpose of alternate nostril breathing is that it calms the nervous system and it helps balance the left and the right brain because we breathe through one nostril um, and then the other and it, there's this cycle of breathing that we do and that helps uh, regulate the brain function. Uh, it also helps us prepare for meditation and it also brings a lot of mental focus uh, as a result of practicing it. Uh, it's also great for just um, improving uh, breathing as a general tool for health and well-being. So it's a great little thing to practice every now and again. I like to practice it sometimes before I meditate. I like to practice it sometimes before I eat. Um, there's lots of different ways it can be incorporated into your daily life. You don't need to do it for a long period of time um, to get the benefits of it, but a regular practice, of course, does help. So there's a certain way to do it because we need to be able to block one side of the nose and then open the other side. So a lot of traditional methods use two fingers on the bridge of the nose where we use the thumb on one side and then the other finger on the other side. Okay, so, and you basically just block one, open the other, and then block the other one, open the other side. So you can just switch between the two. You don't have to do it with the fingers on the bridge of the nose, you could just have the fingers down here, but I like to have this sort of point of reference to keep me focused. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to start by inhaling through both nostrils and then we're going to block one side to breathe out. We're going to breathe in through that side, block it off and then breathe out through the other side. And then we breathe in through the side that we just breathed out. So you always breathe back in through the side that you exhale from, you block it off after you breathe in and then you exhale out the other side. Now, you can breathe in for a count of four, breathe out for a count of four. You could breathe in for a count of four and then breathe out for a count of eight. It's up to you. Different breathing lengths will have different effects on your body. Um, so, but we're just gonna start with a really simple four in, four out. Um, and then you can progress once you're comfortable to maybe four in and eight out. Okay, so. Let's give it a go. We're going to do six rounds and repeat that with a break in between. All right, so hand is on fingertips here on the nose, thumb, other finger ready, not blocking to start with. Take a breath in, block off one nostril, exhale through the other. And we can count for four. And then breathe in for four, block that off, and exhale for four. And breathe in for four, block that one, open the other, and exhale for four. Breathing in, block it off, open the other side, breathing out, breathing in, block it off, open the other, exhale. Breathing in, block it off, open the other, exhale, last one, breath in, block it off and exhale, good, and we'll just rest for three breaths, you can close your eyes or leave them open. Just starting to feel that calm that comes through. Now you might find one nostril is a bit blocked. If you need to blow your nose at any point, then do so. But you'll find this will help clear some sinus congestion as well. All right, so let's get ready to do another step. So fingertips, take a breath in through both nostrils. Blocking one, exhale. Breathing in. Block it off, swap to the side, exhale. 
Breathing in. Swap over, exhale. Breathing in. Swap over, exhale. Breathing in. Swap over, exhale. Breathing in. Swap over, exhale. Last one, breath in. Swap over, exhale. And then again, just relax for a moment. Breathing through both nostrils. So like I said, you can practice with different lengths of breaths. You can practice with different rep repetitions as well. Um, completely up to you to probably play around with as you like. Um, that's just a little intro if you want to have a play. And like I said, do it before you meditate, perhaps doing it um, before you eat as well, just to help calm the nervous system so you don't stress eat. And, and you could even do it as a meditation if you wanted to. So you could really slow it down. Um, but there are some contraindications for people with high blood pressure. So just check with your doctor if that is a problem for you. All right. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you do some practice of alternate nostril breathing and let me know how you go in the comments below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.